Hi guys, Dan here. In today's video I'm going to be doing a graphics comparison for the fairly new Metro 2033 Redux. This is a comparison and it's going to be looking at how the um, game looks kind of visually. Uh, Metro 2033 Redux, as you know, is the remake that they did a week ago of the original Metro 2033. That was actually, um, that, you know, original game actually came out in March 2010. So it's been four years and it's, uh, yeah, pretty good to see, um, you know, how the settings and how you know the actual game looks now because they've totally kind of remade it the graphics are you know really bumped up and to be honest the game's a lot more optimized so you can expect to get more frames if you have a high-end system now on youtube already there's loads of kind of graphics comparisons comparing the original game and um, to this remake so so what i'm going to do is just go through the settings and show you what the quality is like on this actual remake so first off we have our first scenario and here we have the very high settings. So as you can see, it looks pretty nice. I'll uh, give you that. Now at high settings. Now at medium settings. And now finally at low settings. And I, and I will say this game is very optimized. I did find myself on high settings and I got about 80 FPS on very high, about 60, and then on low, I got about 250 FPS. And that is exactly why on a console you can now expect to get 60 FPS because on a console you're probably going to be playing at medium or something like that, but yeah, you do get a lot of friends. Now, onto the next scene. First off, we have uh, very high settings. Now we have the high settings. Now the medium settings. And finally, the low visual settings. So, to be honest, the game looks really nice on all of the kind of settings, but um, yeah, very high looks very, very nice. The textures are really, really nice. I'll give you that. Shadows are really, really improved on, on the high settings, and yeah, the ambient occlusion really does make this game look beautiful. It really does since it's kind of set at night. Now, onto our last scenario. First off, we have high settings, uh, very high settings, sorry. Now we have high settings, medium settings, and now finally low settings. And there we are. So guys, that's the end of the video, and um, thank you for watching, and there should be a Metro Last Light Redux comparison coming very shortly on the channel. Anyway guys, thank you for watching, please feel free to like, comment and also subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in my next video. Goodbye.